I have here a list of contacts and I'm going to demonstrate how to filter this repeating group by the team that the contact belongs to. Uh, and we're going to do this using a drop down uh, and using a conditional statement. So let's go into the bubble editor and we're going to add in our drop down first. And say filter by team. Just to be 100% clear with you, uh, if we go into contacts, team is a text field. Okay, we're not dealing with another data type, uh, it's just a text field. Um, so, first of all, I need to populate my filter. Um, so, uh, so, on the type of choice, it's going to be text because that's the type of field I'm going to be searching. Um, and then the data, the, the choice of source is going to be all of my contacts and then team. Yeah, and I did find something interesting when preparing for this tutorial, which is that you'll see I have multiple Avengers listed um, and it only lists Avengers once. Um, that might be uh, to do with um, HTML dropdowns, uh, or it might be to do with uh, bubble um, knowing, you know, taking a, a good guess at the, uh, I don't want Avengers listed more than once. Um, and because I'm not too sure, I'm just going to be careful and uh, add on the tag here, unique elements. So that way it's only going to display um, no matter if I was to change other parts of the app, I can now reliably know it will only display uh, each team once. So, Next, I need to work with the repeating group. At the moment, the repeating group is just going to display all the contacts in the database. Um, so I can add a conditional statement here, which says that when the dropdown filtered by team's uh, value uh, is not empty, I'm going to change the data source and change the data source to do a search for contact where the team equals, and depending on what you want to do here, you could use keywords, but I know I'm being precise. There's no um, variations of spelling. Um, team equals drop down, filter by teams value. Okay, that's my full list. And let's see if I go on to Avengers. It just shows me the Avengers. If I go on to A team, just shows me all the members, I only missed the T in this case of the A team. Same for Justice League, same for Shield. So that's a quick demonstration of how to use a drop down to filter a repeating group.